Hey, how's everybody doing? So, I'm at the warehouse. I figured I would go through a couple boxes. It, it is a rainy, rainy day. Um, I have this box here, this box. I believe this whole line right here is stuff I haven't gone through um, from that clean out. I know this box with this little bit of doll furniture is. So, I just don't know which box I should do first. Uh, I'm waiting for a friend of mine who's got a plant order that I, uh, I guess I'll do this one first. I ordered a, a bunch of uh, dahlias today to plant in the garden. So I'm going to go pick that up later. Uh, looks like a tiki mug. I got a pair of them. This is a porcelain gnome. It's got to be decent. Has a little red mark there, but I don't know. Uh, I don't know who made it. I think I'm going to use this box again. Some milk glass. Uh, almost looks like a vinegar of some sort or something. I don't know, all this stuff does sell very well on eBay. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to list it. I might do the gnome. Uh, friendly nurse. I think if uh, it's chilled, her clothes come off. I believe it's one of those type of cups. Actually, I've never seen them with the sticker. So, I mean, made in Mexico. Most of this I'm going to probably take to the flea market. Ah, here's another gnome. This one has a little uh, axe, but the label's a little bit easier to read. I think it's made in China or something like that. I, uh, I don't know. Brass trivet. This is actually nice. This is uh, for an oil light or uh, an oil lamp. Nice little arm with some Florida leaves. Cute little vintage iron. My guess is this one swivels. I mean, it's hollow, so maybe they put a coal inside it to keep it warm. But I guess it's not really. I'm not sure. Another little flower. weird three-headed Indian vase. I wonder what this is. Got them for two dollars at a thrift store. Oh, they're like Walt Disney uh, coasters. Kind of fun. I don't know if this one will clean up or not. I'll put that with the Griswold. That might actually be something to sell online. Ah, uh, there's two more of uh, these tiki glasses in here. So a set of four. I bet they sell for 10, 12 bucks each. Um, nice blue shoe. 
press glass. That one's fairly easy to ship. Let's put this with the doll furniture. Where was the doll furniture? I think it's over here. This whole box is all little pieces of doll furniture. So, I do like the handmade rocker. Hmm. Is there anything else in this bag? It feels like there's two little things in this. Might be all broken. No, that was just the chips from the poker. A little tooth vase. That's kind of fun. I like this. This is actually a turtle pin cushion. You can see where you can stick the pins. Mock turtle made in the US. I might actually list that. It's kind of fun. Alright, I'm going to put all this stuff back. Uh, I guess I'll take this to the flea market next time I go. Hopefully it's sooner than later. It's definitely uh, going to get really nice out soon. Alright, what's the next box? Well, grab the next box. Looks like there's a nice little depression glass plate. So that's a little uh, decanter. It's kind of fun. Trying to see what the price was. Fifteen dollars. I might try that on eBay. Hmm. Plastic eagle. I like the carved little wooden dachshund. I'll put that in the maybe to be listed pile. Happy Frog. It's made in Japan. What is this thing? This is actually pretty cool. Somebody uh, welded together a bunch of spark plugs and made a like a little sculpture of a car. It's probably made in Mexico. It's got little Mexican uh, pesos on the wheels. It's still fun. It's a good flea market piece. I guess we'll take this out. Oh, that's actually nice. Good mixing bowl. Probably Hall or McCoy. Um, I'm not 100% sure. Those always sell really good at the flea market. Fiesta Wear uh, it's also does pretty good. That wouldn't be that hard to ship. He got it pretty good. He got it for $3.99 for the blue Fiesta water pitcher. Uh, since it has no chips or cracks, I, I might actually list that. That's a cobweb right there. It's not a it's not a chip or not a crack. I think those still bring thirty or forty bucks. I'm not hundred percent sure. Here. It's actually kind of fun. It's a little iron depression glass. Uh, maybe for holding, I'm not sure. M probably just the lid. But it has a small chip, so I'll save that for uh, the flea market. 
This looks kind of interesting. I don't know if I've ever seen that little angel in uh, I don't know I don't know if it's old or new. I'm not hundred percent sure. It's kinda cute. Oh it's a candle holder. Probably newer. This looks like a Murano glass uh, way a fish or something. Dolphin, but no, nah, it's an upmarked Murano. It's kind of cute though. No, uh, no, that will sell. What else is in here? This is all stuff I didn't pack just because I don't really wrap stuff. I'm pretty bad at it. Sorry. Uh, it's a really nice blue dish. It's not broken. I don't know if it would have had a top. Might have. Be, I guess a bowl also. I'm just hoping one of these things has like jewelry or something wrapped up in it. I did find a little bit of jewelry when I was at the house. Wrapped up. So anything's possible. I think I got that out of the kitchen. Nice little mason jar. Apothecary uh, bottle, or no, I guess maybe this was a chemist bottle. But it's kind of fun with the little nipple that, for the liquid to drain out. Ah, there's the bottom to the iron. So, it worked pretty good. Baby Ben alarm clock. Hmm. I'll look that up. That would ship pretty easy too. Carved beads are kind of cute. A little Mexican pin cushion. This looks like a roll for quarters. I think I have. Ugh, squishy. Something's wrapped up in this though. Nothing. <laughs> little alien guy missing a. Uh, this is actually good. A uh, clip-on bow tie. Those actually, uh, the vintage ones, do sell for 10 15 bucks 15 uh, online, pretty regular. And they're nice and light, easy to ship. I don't think I got any more bow ties besides that one. Let's see what's in this red bag. That would have been fun if that was a real pearl. They're all... Uh, knotted, but I don't believe they're real. Nice, uh, nice and shiny. Not sure who made this red vase, but it is kind of cute. Maybe, uh, I um, honestly don't know. I don't know my glassware that well. more mystery thing tied up. Might be a, another angel. Nope. Something blue. I need two hands to untie this bag. Okay, let's start this bag. Looks like it's a blue covered dish blue glass covered dish. Kind of pretty. It's hand blown. I like that it has its lid. I don't know. Blue always sells at the flea market. Alright, I don't think there was anything else in here. 
unless this is the top to my other covered dish. It just might be. Nope. It's the top to this press glass guy right there. Little Mexican. It's an auction receipt. 2007 is when he was going to auctions. It's a Lusterware Lady ashtray. Um, she broke off a while ago, but it was kind of definitely risque. That will sell at the flea market. I think I'll save this uh, nice little hook to put in the junk drawer. I think I'm going to hopefully be able to finish this box today so that way I can list my junk, junk drawer a lot. Alright. Actually pretty happy with what I found so far to put online. Um, I think the Fiesta pitcher might be the best thing so far. I got one more, uh, one more box to do and hopefully we find something good in here. I'm not sure. Uh, let's see what's wrapped up in this. Oh, that's actually really nice. It's a juicer, but it's painted as an orange. Actually, that might be that might be sellable. It's porcelain. It's not uh, signed by anybody, but it would, looks like it would fit right on top of a glass, and you can do an orange or a lemon right on top. This looks like another box of dollhouse furniture. Little vase what was in that paper. Some arms, chairs, a little bit of everything. All right. Let's move this carefully. I'm going to put it with the other dollhouse furniture. I know. Uh, I know this sells well online, so I will, uh, I'll probably do a couple lots with the dollhouse furniture. Hmm. This is a piece of Fire King. It's got a turtle, it looks like an ostrich and a flamingo. A dinosaur on the other side. That's kind of neat. It's a little uh, kid's bowl. Might might try that. This is another box I definitely didn't wrap, so could be anything in here. A second one of those. Hmm. I'll have to look those up. I'm not sure what... Looks like it's... Nate, maybe, is the... I don't know, or heart, H A R T. Leave the paper there. Maybe there will be more. Well, deco bowl, or. Fancy ties. There's a lot of stuff to unwrap in this one. when the paper is from 2001 doesn't look like this flower has any chips it made pretty nice I do suggest if you haven't yet go back and see this uh this video. Uh, I believe it's the third video I ever did um, of this house. There, there was a ton of stuff inside and I just feel lucky that um, I still have a little bit of stuff to go through. I think this might be a, maybe 
to the top, hopefully. It says Christmas 1941. So. Oh, it's very cute. No chips or anything. Oh. Might actually try that online. It's small enough. It was kind of interesting that it said Christmas 1941. It looks like there's a set of these glasses, the amber glass. Not, not the biggest seller for me. There's one, two, three, four, five. I got two more over there. But these feel like they could be the more of those bowls, the Fire King bowls. Yep. What's nice is the graphics on the dinosaur and everything aren't messed up. So, or the turtle. That's three of them. Looks like there's one more there. Two. Three. So it looks like, uh, Looks like I'm gonna I might get a set of eight. I definitely have a set of eight. A set of ten. And now I kind of almost want to look those up. Let's see what else it is. One more of those glasses. So there's a set of eight of the glasses, but looks like six more of those bowls. Here I'll show you. So I can tell by just feeling them. They're wrapped fairly well. So, they're all the same and they're pretty minty. Awesome. Have to go look these up. It's Fire King. Um, yep. I was just seeing if it had like a product number on it. It says 15 on the bottom. Uh, but I don't know if that definitely hopefully I can find it on online all right I guess we'll do one more box real fast I'm gonna pull all those uh, those bowls out and that way if, if they are good at least I'll be able to find them fairly easy put the hall vase back this is gonna be the last box of the day Nice uh, green deco uh, water pitcher. Let's see what this is. Uh, some more. Uh, this is a candle holder. Kind of. I think it might go with the water pitcher. Hopefully, there's a pair of those candle holders. Feels like a juicer. like the green. Um, divided dish. I'm not feeling like we're going to get an extra uh, candle holder. Oh, that's nice. It's a cigar ashtray with the match, uh, match holder in the center. I do like that one. I might actually try to sell that online. Seems like there's nothing easy to break off of it. Uh, here's, I do have a pair of the candlesticks. This feels like another divided dish. There's a pair of those. Something big at the bottom. I don't know what it is though. This is a footed plate, and the rest are all dinner plates. We got one, we got three dinner plates, but let's see if the footed plate has a, a design on it or not. 
Oh, it does. It's very pretty. It's got uh, daisies, I, I'm pretty sure. I do like that. It'd be a nice centerpiece on somebody's table. Um, all right. I guess that's it for today. I did find a... I might actually have to try to sell that. Uh, sell this. This might actually do fairly well. I would fit it into a flat rate box pretty easy. It seems too nice to sell at the flea market. I'm going to... Yeah, I'll put that on my in my eBay box to, to list. So I got one, two, three, four, I think we'll sell this decanter, five, the box, six, the turtle, seven, um, definitely the, the Fiesta wear. So it's I got eight good items to, to list. I might might list the Disney, but I haven't decided. And I have to look these up. Hopefully they're good, the Fire King. So thank you guys very much for watching. Um, definitely going to have a lot of good inventory to sell at the flea market once it opens. And it's always fun to go through a box that you have no clue what's in. So see everybody later. And if you haven't yet, please give somebody a call. Uh, everybody be safe out there, and thank you very much for watching. Peace.